All right, peeps. Yeah, it's uh, Diddy. Still alive. Looking a bit scruffed. Less beard than I used to have. Shorter hair. <clears throat> a year older, almost. And, um... Uh, yeah, I'm kind of back, I think. I'm not entirely sure because uh, I've been having some like I say real hard times um, depression stuff like that uh, too much work uh, but I managed to get through it last month has felt really nice so um, yeah I think I'm back it's been a, a hard ride I didn't find pleasure in anything, not even music, and uh, that's why I stopped reacting for such a long time. But, as I said, I think I'm back now. Uh, I have been to a couple of uh, festivals and stuff like that, and uh, the last festival was, was on... Uh, the last weekend in Oslo, and um, there I saw some absolutely, totally unknown artists for me, and one artist I knew, and uh, they turned the tides for me, so to say, and I'm going to present them later on. But today... I'm trying out new stuff. As you can see, there's a new room behind me. Uh, both of my daughters have uh, moved away and are studying in other cities. I myself, I got the loft for myself. It's a little bit brighter up here than down in my dark and dull basement. Um, I have a different setup. The sound should be the same, new camera and uh, everything. I still only got two screens. I wish I had a third one, but it will come. It will come. And I'm also using a, a new program for recording these ones. Uh, now I'm using the OBS and it seems very, very professional. And uh, so professional that I've even made myself uh, a scene change because, um, yeah. As you've probably seen in the title, it's time for our beloved Angelina Jordan. I haven't heard anything from her for the last six months, seven months, something like that. I can't remember how, how long I've been away and I haven't bothered checking it either. When did I put out the last video music related? But um, I just saw this one, Angelina Jordan, If I Were a Boy, uh, released, I think it was 12 days ago, live a cappella at St. James Church. This is a song made famous by, by, uh, by Beyonce, but uh, it's actually written by B.C. Jean and Toby Gad, and they released it the same year. But uh, Beyonce made it famous and made the version that we know today. And now perhaps from today we will know the version as Angelina's. So um, before we start, I'm, I'm trying to remember all the things I said back in the days. Um, before we start, remember to go and visit Angelina Jordan's Facebook, Instagram, TikTok, uh, her YouTube channels. Uh, I will always try to put out all the links I have for her in the description below here. And um, yeah, if you like what you see, if you like what you hear, then you Go to the links, go to her channel, subscribe, and like the video. That's 
one way of helping her getting out there in the big world. And uh, I have a feeling it's, it's been a long time since I've seen her. And, and when you turn 18 and uh, you, you tend to grow old rather fast. So, uh, so I'm kind of excited to see what she will bring. I know what she brings to the table. My God, um, the voice and her being is always uh, fantastic. So, uh, yeah. Now let's see. And I hope uh, everything works okay, that the sound is okay. Give me some feedback if the sound is scruffed, okay? Let's go in. This is uh, Angelina Jordan, If I Were a Boy, live a cappella at St. James's Church. Not St. James's, but James Church. If I were a boy, even just for a day, I'd roll out of bed in the morning and throw on what I wanted and go. Drink beer with the guys and chase as a girl. I could kill with who I wanted And I never get confronted for it Cause they stick up for me If I were a bird I think I could understand I would face a lover girl I swear I'd be a better man I listen to her Cause I know I'm hurt When you lose the one you want Cause it's taking you for granted And everything you had got destroyed If I were a boy I would turn up my phone Tell everyone it's broken So they think that I was sleeping alone I put myself first And make the rules as I go Waiting for me to come home, to come home If I were back, I think I could understand I'll be feast to love a girl, I swear That was good. That felt really good. Musically, it was really good. Mm -hmm. huh. Understatement of the year. That was really good. My God, it was absolutely brilliant. And it got the waterwork starting here. So she still got it. She still got it. Oh. 
And as I said, she has grown a lot in the months I haven't seen, heard, followed her, anything. And going on with, like I say, a mega hit like this, because this, this is, this is probably one of the biggest hits out there. Modern hits, that is. And from 2008. And uh, it's just effortless for her. It's just perfection. As you can hear, it's, it's not. It's not a single flaw in her voice, nothing. And you can tell it's an acoustic uh, recording because I, I can hear the, the cars outside the church in the microphone. So she, 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 is, she is 100% music. It's... Uh, yeah. She just deserves to, to how can I say, get that step up amongst the big ones. She still has a little way to go, but she's, my God, she's only 18. So, um, or has she turned 19? No, I think she's 18. I haven't fallen that, that much behind. But um, one, one step at a time, she's on a, not on a ladder, she's on a, a staircase. She's taking the, the good steps up to the top. She's not taking any shortcuts. And she has a, I can say, a bigger and bigger fan base behind her as well. I've seen she's been quite active on TikTok, probably on Instagram as well. And she should be, she should be. She is one of the artists that's going to be there for the next 50, 60 years. So, uh, no. Big applause for Angelina Jordan. It's just so classy. It's just so, as I said, perfect. And I really like the, the, the laid back. I, for me, she could have just sung the song without any... Um, I can say accompanied by, by the piano and the cello, but the, the piano and the cello made, they made the sound in the church, I can say more full. So, um, ah, ah, she is fantastic. I must just say so. Well, if you liked it, you can just do like I do now. Scroll down, give it a like. Over here you can see the subscribe button. Just click on it. It doesn't hurt you. And uh, she subscribed. Yeah, this was the Angelina Jordan official. She has quite a lot of, uh, of accounts. So, and on her page as well, Instagram, TikTok, everything is, is lined up. And I will have it lined up at mine as well. So, uh, no, thank you for watching. I hope this video goes uh, through, as I uh, hope it will. Um, I haven't made videos for a long, long time, so uh, I don't know how the blocking of uh, reaction videos is at the moment. Are they strict? Are they not? Um, are there certain rules for Norway as it? used to be back in the days so to say everybody else could react to videos except me mine got blocked all the time but uh hopefully this one is allowed to be put out there with um with my saying in it i wouldn't call it a reaction i would call more call it a, a kind of a review of the song it's the first time i've heard it it's the first time i've seen it and I loved it. And uh, I also used this, this video to announce my little comeback. And uh, let's just, I'm crossing my fingers that uh, 
what's going up in here is is uh, is done. <laughs> so to say. Well, thank you so much for watching. I'll be back with more. Uh, there will be more Angelina. I will cover a lot of uh, other artists as I opened my Diddy account, YouTube account. There was a uh, yeah. A huge load of new releases of artists which I have reacted to back in the days. So there should be more and more than enough material for me to 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 go through. And uh yeah. For the third time, thank you so much for watching. And uh yeah, see you around. Maybe tomorrow.